other side of the building of nothing was just a parking lot. So I decided to go to the next site, which is the Hanguk National Museum or Korean National Museum and uh, Yongsan Park. We are supposed to be right around the corner, right here on the left. And if you go to the right, you'll be at uh, Hangan or the Han River. So here you are. The left here. Oh, look, post box. It's good to know. There's supposed to be a uh, an ISOU sign nearby. Let's go find that one. And if not, well, just explore the park. I don't know if I'm going into the museum. Well, if not, at least we have the park. There are huge fishes here. They're expecting food. They're so used to uh, people. They come like really, really close. Lovely. Look at how red the leaves are here. Not sure what type of tree it is. But it's beautiful.
I just went inside the Hangul Museum and uh, it was quite interesting actually. It's documented how the Hangul was, uh, well, how it came to be. And apparently, a French linguist from a long time ago deciphered the Hangul into the French language. I do have a few pictures of it, so I'll put them up on Instagram or I'll, uh, I'll throw them in this video. It was a short museum, I think uh, I've been in here for 20 minutes. You have the time and you're here, check it out. It's definitely worth it. And here I am, drinking coffee in hand. Cheers. I'm in Yongsan Park. It's not a big park. But definitely nice to have a seat after a half day of walking. Oh. 
kind of windy too the bat here aside today is wonderful I mean the weather is great and uh, yeah the museums I haven't done the National Museum of Korea I did do the Hangul Museum uh, because I was always interested in the efficiency of the Hangul script as well as the language itself so even though my uh, my Korean is really bad but the other thing that I wanted to talk about is I'm halfway through uh, in my vacation time right now and I'm really gonna miss this place <laughs> South Korea is a really wonderful place, very interesting, a lot of things to do, a very interesting place, a very interesting places to go to, very beautiful, with the Inwang Sun, that's definitely worth the uh, experience. 338.2 meters, I wanted to do Bukhan Sun, but uh, it's very technical, the climb, so I don't know. A guest in the guest house said that it was doable, it's easy, at least for her, and she said like, if it's easy for me, it's uh, it's gonna be easy for you too, but uh, after doing Inwang San, <laughs> I don't know, Inwang San has been technical at some places as well, and I twisted my ankle, it's better now, but I still feel it, so I have to be careful. The other uh, mountain or other park that interested me was park which is also a big park like Bukhansan but not that technical it's a bit outside of the city though it's definitely going to be a day trip yeah I'm I really don't know yet I might put it instead of Gangnam I'm not sure yet Gangnam is big but it's not that interesting to me it's just full of shopping just shopping if you want to go shop go to Gangnam but other than that, there is not much to do there. You also have a stream there, and there is a temple. Uh, and of course, the uh, parts of the kings, uh, where the burial grounds of the kings are. But apart from that, there's not much else to do there. I don't know, I don't think it's for me, Gangnam. So instead of Gangnam, I might do the uh, park I just looked up. Instead of Bukansan, it's coming up next week, so. Uh, that's just a kit. <laughs> Cute. It's definitely not gonna be my last time in uh, Korea. Now that I'm halfway through. I'm sorry, I'm uh, a bit uncomfortable with talking to a camera with people around. I'm kind of new to vlogging, you know. It's not gonna be my last time in Korea. I hope, at least. But it's definitely an eye-opener. My first time. I'm gonna get better at this. My next time in Korea. It's going to be Busan. Sorry about that. I'll just cut these parts out. So just making a gentle reminder to myself that I have to cut this part out because otherwise the video is going to take forever. Uh, I'm going to wrap this break up. I wanted to do the Yongsan Park, but I don't think there's much to do here so I'm just going to exit gonna make my way back to the museum and to the other side of the metro tracks I'm gonna go to Nodelsum Island and it's currently half past two just a little bit after that yeah, Nodelsum Island during golden hour that's the goal and my battery is getting low after I plug it into my battery so it charges because there's still a lot of things to do today. Anyway, bye.